welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. And our live game is Monaco against Panathinaikos. I'm Peter Drury, and this is Jim Beglin. Thanks, Peter. Hello, everybody. We're ready to see what unfolds in this one now. Look at the lineups. identify as the key man in this fixture. I'm going to pick Jean Moutinho. I call him the ferret because he can slip into places and cause trouble before opponents can react. Loves to get between the lines and, and then get his head up. A real creative force. OK, interesting. Oh, good interception. It's come loose. Falcao. chance to break can he find a finish now well, I think it was a little difficult for him to pick exactly the right option there there were so many in the box I don't think we should be totally surprised that he actually went for the shot in the end some good play on the left hand side now to profit from it Looks like a good ball through. Can he finish? Try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Towards the front. Falcao. Great leap! Ball's loose. Who's getting there? We can get that clear. Fabinho drives forward with purpose. Hit into the middle. The clearance and very necessary. towards the front line back out it comes no goals as yet Jean Moutinho pass needed to be better than that and he knows it tries a through ball First half is done, an engrossing half, but we're still where we started, nil-nil. <laughs> That's the start of another 45 minutes. Monaco playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half despite this scoreline converting chances would make a world of difference for them
made sure that that won't get through. Ibarbo. Now the pass. Has he picked him out? Nil-nil still. It's a game that needs a bit of life injected. Looks to slip it through. Ibarbo tries to get it forward quickly. Well into the second half, and still there's nothing between them. Monaco haven't made a substitution yet. It's a loose ball. And that had to be more accurate. that one Loose ball who's going to get that a real click looking for options away from immediate danger Monaco are still in search of that breakthrough goal coaxed out to the wing decent ball admire that from a player from whom we expect to come to the fore at crucial crucial moments doing it however is another matter and his influence just grows and grows a pretty simple finish in the end what do you think Jim yeah good defense is built on positioning communication and you've got to have a desire to attack the ball but they were found really wanting then on all three aspects nobody took charge Nikos have a sub ready to come on. Monaco take the lead. Now it's just a question of holding on. No, that's not the ball he wanted. The time is running out. They need to start pushing forward. And in time is up. And there goes the whistle. Terrific contest, it really might have tipped either way, the margins were tiny, just a goal in it, but that was enough. Well, after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Listen, there was a real concentration on wider attacking outlets and they got their tactics spot on. They found a vulnerability and played on it to the full. It was clever and superbly executed. And just to add, usually if you're enjoying good success from the flanks, it will be shut down or disrupted in some way, but they deserve great credit for maintaining energy and